Hello viewers, you are welcome to my YouTube channel once again. Today we shall take a look, good look at this question. And so, we have s is power 4 minus 25 is equals to 0. Find the value of x. So, let's try to solve this expression. s is power 4 minus 25 is equals to 0. Find the value of s. So, solution. So, for this expression, let's try to make this expression a perfect square. How do you get it to a perfect square? We see, s is power 2 minus 5 squared is equal to 0. So, it, as it is now, it's a perfect square expression. Because if you have, if you multiply 2 times 2, it's going to give you s power 4 minus 5 square. That's 25 is equal to 0. And according to perfect square rules, according to perfect square Law, which, which is equals to a square minus b square is the same thing as a plus b then a minus b that's according to perfect square so now let's liken these rules to our expression so a our a now our a is s square so we see s square minus sorry, plus then our b is 5 then in bracket also s square minus 5. So we now say s square plus 5 is equals to 0. For this, then s square minus 5 is equals to 0. s square plus 5 is equals to 0 for this because yeah, for this. So now say s square is equals to minus 5. This plus will cross to the inequality sign. Then with this one will be s square is equals to 5. So let's try to square both sides. If you square both sides, let's try to square both sides. So if you square both sides, this one will now be s square is equals to minus 5. So this square will cancel this. Then this one will square both sides from here square both sides from this expression also so this one will be s square is equals to this so this one will cancel this so from this expression now we are left with a is equals to square root of minus 5 and from this expression we are left with what x is equals to root of 5 don't forget this plus or minus Plus or minus. So now we can now say s is equal to plus or minus this five times minus one. Then this will still be s is equal to plus or minus root of five. So this is this is going to be a complex number. So we now say this is going to be a complex number. So we now say s is equal to plus or minus root of 5i this is an imaginary number then s is equal to plus or minus 5 so the value of s in these questions are the value of x uh, in this expression we have s is equal to the positive roots of 5i and s is equal to negative roots of 5i and also in this expression in this other expression we have s is equal to positive root of 5 and s is equal to negative root of 5 so the value now of x is equals to our x1 that's plus that's positive 5i our x2 that's negative positive 5i remember this i is an imaginary, imaginary number 
call this imaginary number, a complex number. So our x3, our x3 is equals to positive of this, and x4 is equals to negative of this. So that is the end of this solution to this expression. So if you find this video helpful, please kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel and tell me what you expect in the next video. Thank you.